Hello everyone, it's a whole new week and I have new tarot cards for you. Also this week, coming out in the audiobook is The Captain's Curse. It will be out on Tuesday, so if you love audiobooks, they have had, I think it's been the same narrator for all but one book, and so anyway, she does a fabulous job. So be sure to check that out. Tonight I had my primary guide Morgan drew our cards for us, and tonight we're using the Lightseer's Tarot, and I also had her draw one oracle card from the Sacred Forest, and I am sending good vibes to all my friends and family out there in San Diego as strange hurricane hitting California. What? Hopefully it's just a tropical storm now. Uh, but my stepmom sent me a video of all the rain out there and you know, <laughs> rain just doesn't happen there that often. So I'm sending you guys all good vibes. Stay safe and stay dry. All right, let's see what we got. First up, the Nine of Swords. You guys, we got the Nine of Swords last week in a different deck and I think it was the first card too. What? We have got to do better with sleep this week. So again, the nine of swords is the element of air, so it represents your thoughts. And the nine, it goes in that cycle from ace to ten. Nine is almost fully through the cycle, and this one is all about insomnia. No matter what deck you have, you usually have someone crying who can't sleep. So <laughs> don't forget to meditate before you go to bed so that you can ask Archangel Michael to, you know, make me have no dreams tonight or only good dreams or, you know, please give me a restful seven or eight hours, right? So don't be afraid to ask. Archangel Michael is really good about that. You are not, you know, <laughs> bugging him. <laughs> so be sure that you meditate and and maybe try having you know rain sounds while you're sleeping or something but obviously the universe really wants us to get our rest all right next up ah the ace of wands so wands is the element of fire this is taking action and getting things done and the ace is a brand new cycle of activity so expect to get started on that new project you've been thinking about start it now's the time right so i love that the fire here is right on her third eye trust your intuition and go for it get it done all right this is the, your week okay Oh, but while you're getting it done, be sure that you stay balanced. So temperance is all about, it usually has somebody trying to balance, you know, getting the two cups of water even. I like in this deck how they balance night and day. And you also see the angel wings here. That's a reminder to balance between spirit and material world. So again, this goes with this nine of swords, right? Be sure that you meditate, make time to connect with your higher self, your higher power. It makes a huge difference when we get that little dose of reminder that we're not alone, that we're here for a reason. We came here to learn lessons and we're doing it and we are not alone, right? So balance your, your spiritual with your material and your night and your day. So exercise enough, eat enough, sleep enough, drink enough, right? All those things this week. That, if we can do that, it probably will help with our sleep too. All right. And then from the Sacred Forest, Morgan pulled. Yay. Look at that. The water spirit. It's all about manifesting your dreams. I don't take it lightly that it has dreams right there on the card because we have to sleep in order to dream, right? So if we want to focus on manifesting our dreams this week, be sure that you decide what you want and why you want it. Send it out to the universe and let the universe worry about the how. You worry about balance, right? Keeping yourself balanced while you wait for your dream to appear. You embrace the hustle and go. <laughs> so I do have a manifesting podcast now and it's down below. 
click on it and flip through the different topics that are on there. There might be one that just is the, your ticket to manifest your dreams. Also, um, I just did a webinar last week about manifesting, but I do have a couple spots open in my manifesting mastermind. And I posted a new video this week with one of my masterminders who has manifested her whole new full-time writing career in five months what <laughs> so anyway you can do it too so that link is down below too to um, check that out and schedule a 30 minute zoom with me and we can just talk about what it is you want and see if there's a way i can support you so that maybe you can achieve your dream faster right okay well i'm sending you guys all very good vibes and just to wrap it up we got the Nine of Swords, so we are all going to meditate before we sleep tonight so that we get really good rest. We got the Ace of Wands, so that project you've been wanting to start, here it is. Start it this week. All right. And then we got Temperance, so even though you're all excited about that project, be sure that you eat enough, sleep enough, drink enough, exercise enough, all that kind of thing. And also meditate. Here's your angel wings, so meditate. It's not just material self that you got to worry about, right? And finally, let's manifest our dreams, right? That's what we came here for. So it's going to be a great week. I'm so excited. So I'm sending you all the best vibes. Don't forget to sleep and I will see you next week. Bye.